What's up, my Vina loves? It's Miss Vina D coming to you all from Vina Entertainment News. Now that I've calmed down, I will definitely be playing you guys my initial reaction, okay? But now that I've calmed down and I can be more professional, let me explain what's going on and I will insert my, you know, live reaction when I first heard this story. There's this guy named Marky Mark on Twitter, all right? And he posted a video of Nini at the Reagan airport. And he wrote this one time at Nini Leaks slapped my phone out of my hand, okay? And then he hashtag warehouse for Atlanta. He then tagged Andy, you know, Twitter account into his video, all right? And so after he posted that, the way how he posted it and it was just simple and he moved on, it doesn't seem like this guy is, you know, pressing charges or if Nini is in any trouble. However, I am aware that when you're going through legal issues, you know, you don't come on social media and be talking about, a, you know, a pending case. You know, but the guy just seemed like he's just posting this because it happened to him, but it's really no big deal. However, it's being reported allegedly that, you know, Nini is wanted for questioning, for assaulting a fan. And, you know, that's a title that some, you know, that, you know, some places are running with. But, but from what I see on Twitter, it's just he posted a video and basically just retweeting, um, you know, people reading Nini. So I'm going to get into some of those comments. I'm also going to get into what, you know, people had to say on Twitter, those coming for Nini and those also defending Nini. So let me go through his page and read some of the things he's retweeted about Nini Leaks. This one person wrote, she's acting like she's Beyonce. I think it's so funny how she truly believes she's an A-list celebrity. It's just like okay. So I'm going to continue in, um, the video, but I have to quickly add these two points for those of you who might be like, all she did was touch his phone for being in her personal space. What assault charges? She didn't assault him. All that stuff. You will be surprised. Cardi B husband offset. If you see on the screen, you see those titles on the screen. Yeah. Okay. Offset arrest warrant. Migos rapper accused of smashing the fans iPhone in Sandy Spring. It was a big deal. They were about to arrest the guy and everything because he was in Target. Uh, the fan was just in his personal space. He politely said, hey, man, you know, basically, I'm in freaking Target. This is like my day off. I just want to be in Target and shop in peace. All right. He's not obligated to stop his personal time to take a picture, even though I am aware that, yes, the fans help make these celebrities, but they are still a human being. And the fan insisted, even though Offset was polite, you know, Nene didn't even stop, not obligated to do that, but I'm just saying Offset was polite to tell the fan, not right now. And the fan did not walk away and insisted and then decided to film him and he just snapped and did exactly what Nini did and the fan press charges. And yeah, it was a big deal. But it looks like the fan got a new phone or whatever else he got because Offset settled out of court. And so sometimes these people will do things just to sue you and get money or whatever. But in this case, it's not even that. You can clearly hear a female voice in the background saying, can you take a picture, you know, of me with Nini? And can you take a picture of me? Yeah. With her? Yeah. Can you take a picture The guy is saying, Nini, your fan over there. Hey, Nini, how are you doing? You're your number one fan over there. That's all right, cunt. Basically saying, you know, your fan want to take a picture. So I know that fan, um, if that person is truly a fan and not just, oh, I see someone who's famous in the airport, let me take a picture, was probably disappointed. Like, one, Nini is not obligated to stop her conversation, right, to do anything. But yes, she could have stopped, say hello, take a picture, but she, she missed her flight because, you know what I'm saying? Now, I'm going to explain more, but I just wanted to insert this point real quick. Lavable, okay? This one, how many canceled Hollywood projects again? I mean, just stating facts. Ooh, y'all coming for Nini on your boy. 
OMG, I would have fallen out on the ground like she hit me. <laughs> and get your coins. Wow, she is so full of herself. And Mark retweeted, who does she think she is? Maybe because this video shows the real Nini and not the skinny Photoshop one she keeps posting. Ooh, ha <laughs> ha Yeah, going in on Nini. I'm gonna read. Uh, I'm going now. I'm being all calm, right? Professional, and just explaining the story of what happened. Let me insert my initial reaction when all of this happened. Can you take a picture of me? Yeah. Hey, Nene, how are you doing? You're, you're the number one fan over there. Wait, I didn't That's alright, Con. <laughs> Why am I laughing? <laughs> oh my god. It's probably not even that funny, but what the Nene is sick and tired. <laughs> Nene is like, I don't care. Sue me. I am sick and <laughs> tired of this mess. Can I walk through the airport and be a... <laughs> and you know that girl got on her phone for that very reason. I'm going to get on this phone. I'm going to look like I'm having a serious conversation because I don't want to be bothered. Oh my gosh. But I get it. Celebrities are people too. They want their space and all of that. But girl, okay. So you're on your phone. Just keep walking. You went on, a, you know, I understand she tried to go on the other side and the person still came in her face. Just keep walking. You can't put your hands on people's stuff or touch people, especially with these people being lawsuit happy. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get any type of money out of people. Atlanta housewife Nene Leaks assaults fan on video. She just touched the phone and the phone dropped. Now, if that person phone got a crack on it, now she got paid for the phone. Now you touch my property, you know? Oh, man. Lord. Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to go to Twitter and I'm gonna read some of these comments on Twitter. <laughs> you see, you see what she did? She crossed over to avoid this person, and the person went directly in her way, in her face. Nina, <laughs> you could have kept walking though. <laughs> oh, it's not even that funny, but I can't stop laughing. See. She crossed over to avoid you and you still went in her, like in her face. Look, I don't even care if you are her biggest fan, but hey, talk about rude. OMG, <laughs> she just knocked him down to the floor like he ain't the fourth no floor. <laughs> She's awful. Exactly. She used to be so fun and would put someone in their place if needed. Now she thinks she's some sort of huge star and they are just background players. Time for her to get humble again. Come on, Nene. Make us love you again. She's really spiraling out of control. If you don't like or want to be bothered by the press or fans at times, it's a better way to handle it. Now listen. You know, and that's also a way. Listen, she's on her phone call. She's heading to her flight, right? It's not her job to stop and have a conversation, take a picture and all of that. But Hanini just said, look, okay, thank you for being a supporter. You know, next time you don't have to be this close in my face, but thank you. You know, just something like that and keep it, or just keep it moving, okay? Just keep it moving now. If the person, you know, keeps harassing you, then that's a different story, but... She would be somewhere fit crying and apologizing in a few minutes. Keep it, sucker. We see you. Stay out of her face. These people with camera need to respect people's personal space. Well, there you go. Ha, good luck trying to prove she assaulted anyone. She could easily say she blocked the camera and whoever was holding, you know, the phone dropped it. Highly doubt she's hiding from this accusation. People be hyping the situation up way too much uh, than what it is. 
she tried to avoid being filmed and he did it anyway she pushed his phone down seems fair i mean he crossed he crossed over to be in her face i'm glad she did that he was wrong for being in her personal space see loved nini was my favorite real housewife of atlanta however i overlooked how out of control ego I, I couldn't even watch this year she's changed so much okay and her behavior is gross same she is so obnoxious and it's title now housewives has created some monster Ooh. Andy and Bravo executives didn't seem to bat an eyelash when Nene attacked her co-stars and the cameraman in her messy placid cousin injuries. Not only that, she got a raise. So there you go. Beat up people, break their teeth, choke them against the wall, and get rewarded for it. Mm, mm, mm. So come back. Why do people act like celebrities are not human? Leave her alone. Catch a show on TV. Bleep. Isn't that why they become celebrities in the first place? Especially reality celebrities. They wanted the fame and attention. This B word thing. They can do whatever they please because they are on TV. I hope Nini is sued and arrested. Arrested for what? Dang. Your real house of Atlanta folks go around assaulting folks. But let me guess. Nothing will happen. I can't stand Nini if you don't want to be bothered. Then fly a private jet. Yeah, okay. Now, that she has been called out she is going to try to make some excuse and start crying about why she did don't accept her apologies because it's not going to be sincere or an act why didn't you just ask that person to stop filming you i get it privacy mm, mm, mm. i think fame has gone to her head i never liked her she's very petty and hurtful take her bleep to jail i bet she won't be slapping nothing out of anyone's hand there that's what happened when you think you're better than everyone else. She needs to be knocked down a peg or two. She ruins everyone good time with her nasty attitude. Oh, that dragon eating. And she can't blame depression because she has always been like that. Now, so I wasn't laughing at the guy who tried to take a picture for the fan. Um, because what Nini did, you know, of course, like I said, the guy was in her personal space yes but she still could have kept walking um i was just laughing at the situation where she was just like you know I i'm tired and that part was funny to me but like i say if i see the video from another angle and assault really did happen of course there's nothing funny about that but based on what the guy posted on twitter and the video she just tapped his phone and it, and it fell to the floor and that was that. Also, the part where people keep saying, who does she think she is? She's Beyonce. So that means if it was Beyonce, Beyonce would have the right to smack, you know, someone's phone out of their hand or even touch them or make physical contact. No, it have nothing to do with your level of celebrity. Um, treating people like human beings is what it should be, period, regardless of who you are. You understand what I'm saying? So I don't agree with that part. I've already said it over and over again, so I don't want to sound repetitive, that yes, the guy was wrong for invading her person in the space, and Nini was also very wrong with the way how she reacted. But overall, if this if there's really an assault charge out there and the cops are looking for her and he's pressing charges, then we shall see. But based on what I've read and everything, to he just posted a simple video to reminisce on what happened. Um, you have people saying things like Greg no longer have cancer so what is she going to blame now her depression I'm like you guys are so terrible um, you know to speak on someone going through depression whatever it is that Nini is going through you know I wish her nothing but the best and I hope that you know she finds healing but people are basically just saying that before Greg got sick before cancer, before the depression announcement and all of that, that Nini have fallen out with everybody, Nini been loud, Nini have gotten in arguments and all of that. She was even accused of getting into physical altercations, but of course it wasn't captured on video. So Nini always, you know, said it was a lie. And then the person putting it out there, you know, is a known liar anyway. So it's very difficult on who to believe. But people are just saying, you know, before any of this happened, you've always been 
me this nene so are you going to keep you know so whatever the case might be whatever it is that she continues to go go through i wish her nothing but the best and the same thing goes for greg as he's striving to continue to be cancer free I'm going to go ahead and end it here my friend i left thank you all for your love and support if you're not subscribed to the channel go ahead and subscribe to the channel go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up also turn on notifications so when i do post you where they're posted and i will see you all in the comment section remember to always have the god bless attitude which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation have a great day guys god bless you.